guys this is Melissa from Melissa at home and welcome back to another video I want to share five home-based business ideas to get started with in 2020 and these are free to start these types of home business do not require any investment so I'm just going to give you five home-based business ideas that you can start now today you can start it today or you know you could put it off for some time but I highly recommend that you get started in these business today if you are able to and have the means to do so and again these um, ideas do not require to have money to invest all is required is your time and some energy and a little little bit of research on your part okay of course you will find a lot of ideas out there when it comes to starting a home-based business or just a business in general okay and you may have heard of some of these ideas that I'm going to sh be sharing in this video I may have mentioned them in um, past videos on this channel so you may be familiar with some of these ideas okay? now generally if you're going to be starting a home business or working online and doing an online business you're gonna either fall into these categories you're either going to be selling something or you're going to be uh, providing educational services or consultation services or maybe you'll be um, you know doing blogging or vlogging uh, those are the types of areas that are very popular and that are available so in this video I'm gonna delve a little bit more into those areas I'm gonna share you know a little bit more than just telling you oh you can start an online business in this area and just list the things I'm gonna share with you you know some resources and some information and give you further details and ideas on what you can do like uh, you know if you're going into if you're interested in selling online I'm gonna share with you the types of popular items that you want to sell at this time that will do well and so forth okay so let's get started now the first home-based business idea that you may want to consider again is selling and in this area you could do drop shipping and drop shipping is, is signing up with a wholesale company online that provides a drop shipping um, service and they could drop ship items such as clothing um, beauty items whatever it is that you're interested in selling online and this works great because it cuts out some um, work that you have to do on your end okay so for instance you don't have to have all the products in your home if you do drop shipping the company will ship the items out for you to your cost directly to your customers and you get paid a percentage of the sale okay? so that's basically what drop shipping is in a nutshell and a lot of people do it that way especially those who sell on eBay or Amazon they uh, take advantage of drop shipping programs the companies that do drop shipping that you may want to look into is Aliexpress there's a company called sale who there's Doba wholesale to be worldwide brand and other um, drop shipping wholesale um, online programs that you can join and you can you know start to sell products online now of course you don't want to just get any old item to start selling you want to do your research and see what would sell okay so you want to look at the market and where we are today and see what are the needs of today and then try to get items that will accommodate those needs people are staying home and people are going to be working from starting to work from home and so forth so you may want to look at home life type of products to drop ship and sell you could sell you know comfortable uh, clothing items such as sweats or robes or comfy socks um, maybe slippers maybe some drinking mugs and for those who are working from home you may want to look at you know home office supplies like computer desk and so forth and you can sell those types of items that will cater to those who are now you know at home and are thinking about starting to work from home okay or starting a business from home so you want to look into look at your market and see where we are today in the economy and what the needs are at this current time so those are some ideas I'll list some more ideas of what you can look for to sell online and, and I'll try to list those below this video the second home-based business idea that you may want to consider is uh, making and selling digital products okay you could create ebooks and sell them online that's a digital product that people can download and you can also you know create courses if you're uh, if you are knowledgeable in a certain area you can join Udemy sites like Udemy and create courses Udemy is the most well-known um, online platform that allow you to sell courses so there's there's other um, platforms that are similar as well and I will list those below this video but you could create 
online courses that people can purchase and download and you can make money in that way and start an online business by selling ebooks again and courses if you're not interested in selling ebooks or courses you're not you know someone who can create or teach uh, courses and so forth or interested in you know producing ebooks then you can sell downloadables and downloadables are basically uh, things that people can download and use posters or presets. Presets are basically photo enhancement tools that help people to, you know, enhance their photos and create different styles so that it is so that it looks more appealing. So you, you may find, you know, some Instagrammers may have like a scheme or a theme on their Instagram, a certain color scheme that they may have, and those are like similar to presets. Okay, so you can sell presets. These are downloadables, and you don't have to send like a physical product to anyone's home, right? So it's a lot easier to sell downloadables so again you can look into selling presets which is photo enhancement tools um, you can sell posters you can also design um, you know uh, covers for ebooks you can also design planners and activity principles that's geared towards children so they can you know color or whatever it is and teach children so you can do uh, downloadable printables and, and sell the, in those different areas okay so I'll post some more information below this video uh, there's a link that will take you to a website and it will give you some further details on how to sell downloadable printables and it'll give you some ideas on the types of prints that you could sell okay that do really well and Etsy is a great site to use to Etsy have individuals who who actually sell downloadables that they create and you can use canva and PicMonkey to create your design it's free site like canva offers you a free access to create different designs and posters and social media posts and so on and planners and anything that you can think of that is geared towards you know designing so definitely check out canva i actually use canva to create my thumbnails so the thumbnails that you see majority of the thumbnails that youtubers uh, create some of them use canva to do that okay so canva have a lot of uh things that you can do and create and you can use use it to sell uh print printable download um digital products and if you are like a graphic designer and you're into designing you can design logos and sell those as well using canva another home-based business idea that you can look into is doing voiceover work i actually did a full video i believe i did a video uh, talking about how you can get started in doing voiceovers and i shared some companies that actually hire voiceover artists okay now i'm not a voiceover artist let me clear that up because when i posted that video i had tons of emails from people who are looking for suggestions for me and tips and, and advice and so forth in how in, in how to get started in doing voiceover work well i'm not an expertise in that area i do not do voiceover work i just you know present some ideas to you guys so voiceover is just another idea that you can look into as you know to start a home-based business if you have a beautiful voice or you've gotten compliments about your voice and so forth then you can look into doing some voiceover work you can go into being a narrator where you narrate books and create audible books for people to listen to so you can look into that area as well you can also look into doing explainer videos for youtube for youtubers where they sometimes hire uh, individuals to do voiceover for their videos and um, these types of videos are more like educational where they may be explaining some Something, okay so you can also look into reaching out to uh, smaller uh, companies and small businesses and connecting with them and offering them voiceover services to do small commercials for them to help promote their business as well so there are different areas you can go into when you do voiceover work okay so definitely consider those categories the third thing that you can do a home-based business idea that you can get started with is doing some virtual assistant work and I have you know spoken about this multiple times I've touched on this area so virtual assistant is someone who have administrative um, skills and this is someone who works for different clients virtually to set appointments to make calls for them to make uh, you know to set up schedules for them you could organize files for different clients if you have interpersonal skills um, phone skills all of those things that you were working at your former job or at your job outside of your home you could take those skills and package them into a service 
and label yourself as a virtual assistant, you can start reaching out to different companies and CEOs and offer your virtual assistant um, services to them, okay? You can let them know that, hey, I can answer calls for you, I can schedule for you, I can help you to get more organized. So definitely look into becoming or starting a virtual assistant business from home. The next home-based business idea that you can also look into, of course, is doing is starting a freelance business, okay? Of course, with freelancing, you can go in multiple areas similar to being a virtual assistant. Now, to get started in building your freelance business, you can sign up with sites like Fiverr as well as Upwork. Fiverr and Upwork allows you to, you know, definitely utilize your creativity, right? So if you're a writer or proofreader or editor or you're into web design, then these are skills that you can package into freelance and offer freelance service, okay? So definitely consider doing some freelancing. If you are to join Fiverr and you wanna um, sell, service, sell your services on Fiverr, well, these are the most popular, well-known um, services that are booming right now on Fiverr where people are making the most money. So the first service that people are making the most money in freelance area on Fiverr, website building, developing websites and marketing, okay, like SEO experts and so forth. So those are the areas that are most popular right now. Of course, it makes sense because people are, you know, working from home and starting a business and managing their websites via online. So of course, they're turning to experts like web developers and designers and marketers to help, you know, to help build their presence online. So those are the most popular areas and gigs that are selling on Fiverr and people are making well into uh, 13,000, you know, per gig doing this, okay? So if you're into tech support or web design, then definitely look into, you know, starting a business on sites like Fiverr or Upwork. Another area that is booming right now on Fiverr that you may wanna look into is video marketing. Video marketing, such as creating explainer videos for YouTubers is huge right now, okay? Another area is creating animation videos as well as creating short video ads, okay? So those are the most popular services that are being offered on Fiverr and the most lucrative right now. So definitely consider these five home-based business ideas for 2020, especially with the economy, the way it is, these are businesses that will do really well for you, okay? So don't forget to check all the information and resources and links that'll be posted below this video. And thank you so much. If you enjoyed this video and it was helpful for you, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe as well as hit that notification bell for new video uploads. And that's all I have for you guys today. You have a safe one and happy work from home. Bye-bye.